Right, we are going to use speech selection to make reading on an iPad uh, easier to view when surfing the web and to have text read to us. Uh, to enable this feature, we go to settings first, uh, then to general, and then scroll down to accessibility and then look for speech selection. Mine's off, I'm going to turn it on. When you turn it on, you then get a list of uh, choices. Uh, dialects for New Zealand, closest link is uh, Australian English, but you might like to try around with some. Uh, the speaking rate is how fast the text is read to you. I like it about there, but you can make it a bit slower. Speech selection reads selected content. And I turn the highlighted words to on um, so that um, as the words are read to me, um, I can see which words are being read. Okay, that's all I have to do now. Now, um, just generally text, say I was in pages, for example. And you want to, it to read its first paragraph to us. So you press and hold a word for starters. Um, we're not going to select all, we're going to select some. That first sentence right there, and then as you finish selecting, you say speak, cut, copy. We want it to speak. One day, Captain Jack Black was on his big black pirate ship looking for treasure. Easy as now, um, it's really handy uh, to combine a couple of features when surfing the web as well. So, here is uh, my blog, and we're looking for the word reader up in the web address. I'm waiting for it to completely load and we will see by very fast internet connection that the word reader doesn't pop up. It needs to be a body of text not a whole lot of um, bits and pieces like different blog posts. So let's just click on that one blog post. Look at the top there and you'll get the word reader. See it? So click on it. You get the page of text without all the sidebar issues. If visibility is an issue, then click on the A and it makes it a bigger size, should you want that. It's a bit like me. Now I wanted to read that first paragraph to me, so do the same thing. Select the wee bit. And I wanted to read that first paragraph to me there. And speak. I came across this article on the staff website about children's use of Facebook at a Wellington primary school which had got itself in a bit of strife when trying to sort out issues around children's use of Facebook. I think it's a really nice feature to help children uh, access print for the, um, and also to make reading easier by getting rid of the distracting text. Hope this helps you and your use of an iPad.